Okay, so apparently I have a little stalker on YouTube and she stalks my Facebook page. So I wanted to make this quick video. Um, you guys know how Facebook has an others inbox. Well, this message was sent to me back in October 16th, but I didn't see it till now because for some reason I was going through my inbox trying to send a message to one of my friends and I, um, I realized that I had a few messages on my others box. Uh, most of the messages were people who have seen me on um on youtube and they follow my channel and they like my videos and they tried to ask me questions about ttc uh, and i never got those messages till now i hate when facebook does that for some reason i don't i don't know why they have those restrictions and they send uh certain messages to the others box and you really won't see them you won't even get alerted that you receive those messages unless you actually go out of curiosity and check inside your uh others box so anyway i deleted the message which i regret but it's just a force of habit that when um somebody sends me a nasty message i write back to them i delete the message and i block them and that's that in the past and normally i don't waste time on um haters or stalkers but i just think that it's funny because she actually told me in her message that i shouldn't judge people because uh they smoke weed or because um you know they go to clubs which uh, I don't know where she got that information from because I have never in my life judged people who go to clubs um, everybody is entitled to have fun and live their life the way they want to um, and in regards to the weed I don't judge people who smoke weed I plain and simple stand up for what I believe is right or wrong and my personal opinion and view is that I am NOT for weed I don't like weed I have never touched it in my life I will never touch it in my life and uh, therefore, I, I have a right to speak up about what I feel, what I think, and what I believe. So in her message, it was pretty much saying, oh, you shouldn't talk because you have kids and you never know if, um, in the future, it's going to, karma is going to come and turn around and bite you in the ass and your kids are going to. First of all, let me stop right there. My kids, I raised them right. My kids are being instructed since they're little boys. So um, therefore, uh, let me clear that up. Um, karma is not going to bite me in the ass because I raise my kids well and when you instruct them in the way that they should go they will never depart from it and that's something that's biblical and that I believe in that I stand up for second of all you said in your message that you look at my videos because you find them interesting so that's how you found my Facebook page but that you find me interesting but not interesting enough to add me as a friend so in other words you're a stalker right there it's red flag um yeah so you are pretty much a stalker if you don't uh like my views on things my opinions that's your problem not mine but i think it's funny that um if you have this whole problem with how i see things and what I stand up for or if you think I'm coming across as judgmental that's your problem that's not really mine I really don't care what you think of me but I just think it's funny and amusing how um, you don't find me interesting enough to add me as a friend on Facebook yet you uh, watch all my videos and apparently I'm sure you're one of the people who thumbs down my videos which in actuality I really don't care I find it amusing that you actually have so much time in your hands that if supposedly you dislike me for whatever reason or you dislike uh, my way of thinking or my opinions and my judgment on certain things I just think it's amusing that you actually waste your time on actually watching my videos and here is the proof that you are a stalker because obviously I don't have you as a friend. Yes, my Facebook page is public. Everybody could see my Facebook page. But it's funny that you actually know everything that I post on my page. Why? Because you must have no lies stalking my Facebook page every single day to see what I write. So I think that's hilarious. So I just wanted to bring it out there, you guys, because yes, apparently I have a YouTube page. Facebook stalker and I think all of us have uh, once or twice have had to dealt with those type of people so you know I just found that found it amusing and I think it was funny that she sort of contradicts herself 
so um you know if she actually thinks that of me if if she doesn't uh find me interesting enough to add me as a friend why does she watch my videos i have no idea who understands people some people really need some help and maybe you know they have some screw, uh, loose screws up in the head because honestly that's something that i don't understand um if i don't like someone i don't waste my time looking at their videos looking through their facebook page because honestly i don't care i don't care about their life if i dislike them i will not waste my precious time on checking them out on seeing what they have to say today on seeing what they're gonna post today on seeing what they're gonna talk about today on their videos it's ridiculous it cracks me up so that's all i wanted to say sweetie get a life so if you're stalking my videos and you're subscribed to my videos um you must really love me you must really love my life because you gotta be all up on it so you know whatever think what you want um i'm not a judgmental person i simply speak for what i believe in i stand up for my views uh for my beliefs for morality I stand up for what I believe is the right way because I was raised a certain way and uh, I am not saying that I'm perfect and I'm not saying that my right is that my way is a hundred percent right but uh, yeah be careful karma doesn't bite you in the ass because um, you're the one that's coming across as judgmental with that little message you sent me and about my boys don't talk about my boys because my boys I are being raised very good and my boys are not gonna turn out to be those things that you say karma might bite me in the ass and that they might turn out to be so please with that said get alive don't waste your time sending people messages if you don't like them if you don't like the way they think they talk they believe in if you don't like their opinions why waste your time obviously you have too much time in your hands to actually take time out of your day to send me that message so you know whatever get a life please if you want to continue watching my videos go right ahead if you're gonna keep sending me well i blocked you on facebook so you can't send me messages but since you're such a stalker i wouldn't doubt that you have a little fake page so that you can keep stalking me on facebook so hey honey stalk away whatever i actually have my page public so that my haters could check up on me because i love pissing off my haters so bye bye have fun stalking stalk away bye